pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. I'm Charlie, and that is Spencer, and this is your Friday Ingleside News. Speaking of academics, did you see the academic poll? Yeah, it was very interesting and very well done by all students. Yeah, same. I thought they were all pretty smart children in many different ways. According to the United States Constitution, how often do we vote for president? Will. Every four years. Correct. My name is Ari. My favorite class is math. I want to go to MIT, and after college, I want to be an aerospace engineer. Two states were admitted to the union, making them the... Alaska and Hawaii. Correct. <laughs> Part of this and sitting in front of your friends and answering questions and having that pressure is awesome. So thank you very much, guys. You are a great audience too. Thank you very much. Anyway, let's talk movies. Some coming soon and some will come in the following future in the lifespan of five years. First, we have Scoob. That's Scooby Doo. We have Frozen 2 coming in like a week or two. Then we have Star Wars, of course, and then SpongeBob 3, basically. Godzilla vs. King Kong, which is going to be a banger, Shrek 5, and Conjuring 3. There's a uh, dining for your dollar bills on Monday at Panera Bread. You can dine for your dollars at 4 to 8 p.m. at the Panera Bread on 44th Street and Camelback. Panera Bread's mac and cheese is the greatest food on earth. Don't even try to change my mind. Thank you to everyone who wore their jersey today. Speaking of jerseys and sports, now to Lauren! What's up, Ingleside? I am Lauren here with these sports. The festival is tomorrow. Boys soccer starts at 8 a.m. on the Desert Manton High School Auxiliary Field. Girls soccer starts at 8 a.m. at Chaparral Park. Softball starts at 8 a.m. at Chaparral Park. 8th grade boys basketball at 8 a.m. at Desert Man High School. 7th grade boys basketball at 8 a.m. at Sorara High School. 6th grade boys basketball starts at 8 a.m. at Coronado High School. Good luck, Trojans. Arcadia basketball, who found out the team? I personally can't wait for the game to start. Arcadia football is coachless, and there's news that the new coach is coming to your local high school. Hopefully it's a good coach that brings the Titans to an undefeated season next year. Back to Spencer and Charlie. Thank you, Lauren. Hey Charlie, did you hear about that dog with a tail between its eyes? I actually did not hear about that. Yeah, it's super cool, weird, and kind of cute. Here's more on that with Kate. Hi Ingleside, it's Kate and I have a special report. Have you heard of the puppy named Narwhal that was born with an extra tail right in the middle of its head? It may seem hard to believe, but it's true. People are calling him the unicorn dog because of that one extra tail. That extra tail is caused by a birth defect similar to polydactism, which means having multiple toes or fingers. Anyways, the dog is a symbol that being different is good. Now back to your anchors. I mean, if no one claims it, we good. Shh! Oh wait, Ingleside, there's a robotics! December competition! Mark the date!
um, so normal puppets, they can't floss, and that's an issue. So what we need to do is we need to build them electronically to floss and renovate the future. Okay, is that it? Anyway, bye. It's so hard to say goodbye to yesterday.